hey guys and welcome so today i have a wig from nadula hair and this is the wig right here it's a body weight wig and it's 24 inches and it is absolutely gorgeous so i just wanted to show you guys this before i put it on my head and all that so here she is it has like the baby hairs i have done nothing to this wig except part it and put some foaming mousse on it just to lay it down um but that is it and i'm going to show you guys what the inside of it looks like okay so this is the inside of the wig um so there's lace on the front part of it and then there are three combs two on the side one on the back with adjustable straps but i'm going to go ahead and install an elastic band just for some extra security because you know i really don't glue my wigs down so having that band is very good. Hey you guys, it's me Morgan and welcome back. I feel like I have been gone forever. I haven't done a wig video in a minute, but today I have one and it is from Nadula Hair. I'm so excited to try this wig out because it is absolutely gorgeous, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in closer. I have my wig right here on the mannequin head um, so I can show you what it looks like, but this wig is so bomb you guys okay all right so before I cut the lace and do all that I just want to show you guys what it looked like in the front so in the front you do get lots of baby hair um, I did not pluck the knots or anything on here or pluck the lace in the front or anything like that and it looks pretty good these baby hairs are so long like look how long these are they're super long so I'm gonna be cutting that um and i just have a middle part going on i do not have a cap underneath my hair or anything like that but i'm gonna go ahead and install this elastic band and cut the lace off and then i'll be back <laughs> very very short so I can give some baby hairs I'm gonna use this style factor edge control to lay them down now all right you guys so this is the final look of my hair um, I went back and kind of like try to redo my baby hair a little bit because I've been trying to keep my part in the middle. Every time I do baby hair, my part ends up being crooked. Um, as far as the baby hair part, this part is usually straight, but the baby hair part, it looks crazy sometimes, but yeah. Um, so yeah, this is it. I absolutely love it. This hair is so soft, you guys. I have not styled it or anything. Um, I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like coming straight out of the box and what you guys would get. So, if you guys can see, I'm just taking my Dimmon brush and I am going straight through it. It is very, very soft and I believe this is 150% density. Um, I actually like brushing it out and then taking the hair and twisting it like this. Um, you can put a little bit of a lightweight oil at the end to help with like any frizziness or anything. But putting it like that and then just kind of fluffing it out a little bit to give it some nice little waves. But overall, I love it a whole, whole lot. Um, if you guys love like super long baby hairs, this is for you because girl, those baby hairs were the audacity of that car being so loud. Anyway, the length of these baby hairs were so long. Um, I definitely had to cut it because I like to go for a more natural length look baby hair. So yeah, that's what I did. And also, um, I did not bleach the knots on this. Um, I just used this EBIN New York Tinted Lace Spray. And I used the shade Light Warm Brown. I, feel, I think this is the lightest one. I don't know they have like eight or nine this might not be the lightest one there might be a lighter one but i use this i got this uh on amazon but i went to target they do have it at target so if you're interested don't feel like ordering on amazon you get it at target as well but yes you guys i'm going to stand up so i can show you how long this is on me um so i'm five three 
and it comes down to here. Um, like I said, this is 24 inches. So if it's pulled straight, it comes further down. But yeah, that's where it is. It is super, super thick. Like I said, it's 150% density. I will make sure I leave all the specs below in the info box if you're interested and any coupons below as well. Um, and I just really, really like this hair, you guys. Also, like I stated before, um, I did not glue down this wig, you guys. I do not like gluing my wigs down just because I work out literally every single day and there's no point of me gluing it down when I'm just going to sweat, sweat like crazy, and it will just come off anyway. So I like to use an elastic band, which they did provide an elastic band. So I do have an elastic band so it can secure my wig down so I can move my head wherever and it won't go anywhere. And also I like the elastic band as well because it lays your hair flat. So y'all saw what my hair looked like in the beginning what it looks like underneath uh, so as long as your braids are pretty much flat your wig will lay down pretty flat and to me this is very flat also i did not pluck the part so i might go back and do that um, just to make it look a little more natural but i don't think it's that bad um, especially like just getting it straight out the box that's what it's looking like but yeah, you guys, I love this hair. It's giving me like summer beach vibes. If you want the hair bigger, you can always pick it out, make it bigger. And then also this hair can be curled, straightened, whatever you want. But in this video, which I usually do in other videos, I'll style it. But this video, I love the pattern of it so much. I just wanted to keep it like this because it's very flowy and it's such a beautiful day outside and I'm just I'm just getting beach vibes pool vibes today so yeah so I'm gonna turn around so you guys can see what the back looks like as well all right you guys so that is my hair I hope you enjoyed it please tell me what you think about this wig I'll leave all the coupons and details, specs, all below in the info box. And I'll see you next time. Bye, you guys.